Hey everyone, popped out of here. I'm back again and uh, pretty close to my last review, which was my Hocus Pocus uh, 2 review. And uh, I realized we've got about a little less than three weeks left till Halloween. So I thought I gotta start cranking out some of these reviews or I'm not gonna get to everything I wanna review with these one a week reviews. So here's a little bonus review this week. Hopefully I'll have another one. Uh, stay tuned. Um, also, a uh, little Pop Baby update. I got little Miss Pop Baby with me on this uh, nice and cool fall day. So it's good hanging with her. How you doing, Pop Baby? You doing good? Yeah, she's doing good. She's smiling. Uh, as you can see, I'm in Pop Mama's car because Pop Mama's dad, Pop, 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 had to uh, borrow Pop Daddy's car. So I'm in this one. So I'm coming today with uh, two reviews. First one being of Marvel's Werewolf by Night, which is another uh, Disney Plus movie. This one is about a bunch of monster hunters who come to Bloodstone Manor to mourn the death of their leader, uh, Ulysses Bloodstone. In exchange, one of them will hunt a monster on the ground. Those who defeats the monster and gets the Bloodstone will be the new leader of the... Yeah, she enjoyed it. Would be the new leader of the um, Monster Hunter gang. So, uh, one of... One of the uh, monster hunters has a terrible secret. Well, not a terrible secret, but a secret uh, that he's trying not to get out. And one of the monster hunters is played by Gael, Gael Garcia Bernal. I hope I got that right. As the charismatic and mysterious Jack Russell. And this was a uh, short special. It's only about an hour long. Uh, it was directed by composer uh, Michael Giacchino. And his uh, direction style is amazing. It's in black and white, and it's like one of the old-timey monster movies. So that it was very enjoyable. Also, it's TV PG, so you know you can watch for the kids. The kids might enjoy it. Um, at, but in all honesty, kids also might find it a little bit boring. So you know you might want to check it out before they do. It's in like I said, it's in black and white, so there's no blood or anything like that. But it's a good time. It's very well done. So. You know, give it a chance. If you got an hour to spare, it's... I can foresee it becoming something I watch every year around Halloween. And that's really awesome. So, if uh, you like monster movies, you're going to like that. Now, uh, review number two. I am coming from the lovely city of Scranton. I had to come out here for other reasons, but... In Scranton is the closest Krispy Kreme. And this year, if you uh, are reading my blog, when I get closer to Halloween, you'll see that there's a going to be a review of last year's Krispy Kreme donuts, which I bought on Halloween. But today, I thought early, and we have these, which are Krispy Kreme's Knock Knock Booze There, Scary Dozen. See them in there? They're good. There are three flavors. There's the Scaredy Cat Cream Donut, the Boo Batter Donut, and the Spooky Spider Donut, and the Neon Orange Sprinkle Donut. And uh, a dozen of these will run you about $14.00 which is $5 more than a regular dozen, but these are special ones, so um, I'm gonna try three of them for you. I'm just gonna take a bite and then put them back. I'll finish them later. But um, uh, Chad from Horror Movie Barbecue recommended these to me, so I said I gotta check them out. And uh, ooh, they look good. So I'm gonna start off with the Scaredy Cat Donut. This is apparently just a regular uh, cream donut, as you can see, purple with, uh, or wait, I was upside down, because that's grass, and that's a purple sky, black bat, uh, and black fence. I guess there's there's no cat on there, but um, let's try it. Yeah, just a regular cream donut. Nothing, um, nothing too exciting there. I'm not usually a fan of cream donuts, and this is like the white whipped cream, not the, uh, yellowish pudding cream that's usually like Boston cream donuts. It's okay. Uh, our next one is the Boo Batter Donut. Ooh. Which is another filled donut. Let me take a bite of it here. With um, green, black, and purple sprinkles. Like sugar crystal sprinkles. And a hard sugar ghost on top. About seven or eight years ago, they had Ghostbusters donuts, and I'm assuming it's the same kind of hard sugar 
uh, ghost that was on them, so, well, not the same kind of ghost, but the same kind of hard sugar thing, so, let's try this guy. That one's pretty good, the, um, the cake batter is a good taste for the inside of a donut, I like that. It's not too bad. And finally, spooky, spooky spider donut, you know, like a spooky spider. This one has a frosting top, a uh, hard sugar spider, cookie crumbles, and uh, chocolate frosting. So there we go there. Let's try this guy. Okay, so out of those three, I think the uh, spooky spider one's my favorite. I thought for sure it would be the cake batter one, but that spooky spider, the... I love the Krispy Kreme original glazed donut, so that one was good, and it had like chocolate and cookie crumbles, so that was good, so if you have a uh, Krispy Kreme near you, scare yourself up a dozen and head on over there. If you also have a slushy drink, which is like grape flavored with apple, with uh, sour apple flavoring in it as well, that's a cool purple green one. What do you think, little mister, we go back for that one? What do you think? <laughs> She got a big smile on her face, so it looks like we're heading back there. I'm not going to give any to her. So, yeah. Uh, also, Hocus Pocus contest is uh, going on still. Uh, you got to get out there. You got to share the uh, statuses that I share on the Facebook page. You can have a chance at winning one of two cups. Uh, there's Winifred and there's Sarah. So, you know, you can't win it if you're not in it. Maybe I'll edit that out. But, you know, like, comment, share, subscribe. And, you know, I'll see you next time. I'm probably going to... Um, Announce the winners during my the first week of November, so or the first video in November. So keep an eye out then. Until then, you know, make sure to comment, like, share, subscribe. I'll see, see you soon. Peace.